Today is a bittersweet day here on First Take. As it is Max's final show, we are going to take a look now at some gems, Max, some of your best moments. And we welcome the newest member. We are so fired up of the First Take family here, Max Kellerman. So good Thank to have you. Thank you very much. Composing the top. Who do you want? You want Blake Griffin or you want Melo? Blake Griffin. You, you, want, you, you want Blake Griffin yeah. over yeah. Carmelo yeah. Anthony? Yeah. Yeah. Tom Brady's just about done. He is going to fall off the cliff. When Coyote style. Meet me. When, 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 is your coffee spiked in the morning? What's going on? Spike your genius juice. Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. The proper honeymooners reference here is hamana, 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 hamana. Now I'm going to get into the, the word Goldilocks. This is the definition of player hating. Lay on the ground. You've been right. Ah, Are you ah, joking? Ah. Ryan Hollins. Imagine a guy your size, but really good at basketball. Like, think about that for a second. I was wrong, Tom Brady never fell off a cliff. Now it's time for story time with Uncle Max, everybody. Gather round, young children. Uncle Max has a, has a science lesson. Fate of the universe on the line, or the Martians have the death beam pointed at Earth. You better hit it. I want Iguadala. That's right. I even made a little diagram. I don't know if you can see it. There's a little stick figure and there's the boulder going up the hill. The answer to the question, does Kawhi have the best shot to stop LeBron, is no. Let me put an APB out for Max Kellerman. Where the hell is he? That's right, show that face, Max Kellerman. Show that face. You've got to be kidding me. Is Wentz the regression that I identified last year? Is it continuing this year, yes or no? No. <laughs> oh, God. Impervious to reality. Because I know it was a tough day for you yesterday. This, this is for Knicks fans. It's a glass half empty, but hold on, I think this is more like it. Just leave one little drop. See, there's a little drop on the bottom. It's a glass almost entirely empty. That's for you. Molly, I thought they were supposed to get KD and Kyrie, the Knicks. The backhanded compliment to Ryan Hollins. First of all, just let me Ryan's say Ryan's great, dude. Ryan's great. That was a compliment. Yes. Ryan lasted can, 12 years in the league. I cannot believe it has been five years. Yeah. We have had so much fun on the show. Obviously, the pandemic. Um, Max, honestly, I've had so much fun sitting next to you. All the travels, all the trips, getting stuck at airports, all that things. Uh, you're a class act, but most importantly, I've met a friend for life. And uh, congratulations. I know you have new shows, and I'll, I'll, let you, I'll let you announce that whenever you feel comfortable. But I'm really excited for you for your next chapter. And I'm still going to see him every day. So, of course, me, I'm getting emotional, but it's not goodbye. Um, Molly, first of all, anyone who wants to know about Molly, salt of the earth. It's, it's great to know you and exactly, you know, a friend forever and all that. And Molly made me feel so welcome right away on the show and gave me the lay of the land. And it's been a great five years. What I'm struck with, watching those clips of myself, I knew how articulate and uh, smart I was, of course. <laughs> how excellent Always on television. Always good looking. But what, that's what I was struck with. So, so handsome. handsome. So handsome so through handsome. the years. No one ever told me. I know, right? So handsome. Our hair uh, color changed through the years. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh you think a little bit? Both. The last five years has not been kind to the hair color. But it's been a great five years. I got to tell you, the people who work on this show, and like you always hear this, if someone's at the end of a show, someone's leaving yeah. a show behind the scenes, and there are too many people to mention, there really are and uh, just a bunch of good people. And getting up every morning and coming into work, like, kids, you know why you want to work in this business? It beats working for a living. Yeah. We're stealing money here. Like, we get up and every day to argue about sports with our friends. You know what I'd be doing if I wasn't on show? Arguing about sports with my friends. My friends are on TV and, yeah. and everyone gets to see it and I somehow get out of working for a living. So yeah. and, this, I, we, I will continue to get out of working for a living talking yeah. about sports, but no longer on We've had show. so much fun. Yes, you're going to be on TV a lot, but somebody else wants to say something. Do we have Stephen A. here? Yes, you do. Hi. Hey, everybody. Can y'all hear, can y hear me loud and clear? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let me say this. First of all, my apologies for not being there. Just so everybody knows, I have not been on the air over the last two weeks. Because this big nose of mine, if you can believe it, I actually look uglier than I normally look. Because I had surgery for my sleep apnea on my nose. And that is about why time. nobody has seen. It's about damn time. Right, Max? It's about damn time. Did you I tell them to shave a little nose. off while they were at it? Or they left it as it? <laughs> Ma hey, hey, yeah. hey, Max, are you ready for this? It's actually I have sleep bigger. apnea, too. I need to fix something. Go ahead. Sorry, Stephen. That's, that's right. The, the, the nose is actually bigger and more swollen and all of that other stuff. That is why I couldn't be on the air. All I wanted to say was to call in and to, and to, thank, and to thank my man, Max, for the five years. 
originally when we talked, it was supposed to be a three-year run, and the next thing you know, it's a five-year run, and we've been number one every single year, and you had an awful lot to do with that. I wanted to thank you for your contribution to the show. I wanted to call and wish you nothing but the best moving forward because you're going to be doing th- big things like you've always been doing big things, and I just wanted to let you know, my man, I'm calling to wish you nothing but the best, and I'm really sorry that I couldn't be there to tell you face-to-face to thank you for everything that you did for the show over these last five years. That's Thanks, why I was Stephen A., I'm glad you called in. Um, it means a lot. And as did, people understand that Stephen A. had a lot of say who was going to be his partner um, after Skip left the show. And it was I was honored to be, have been chosen and wouldn't trade the last five years for anything and uh, uh, appreciated it through the years. And also, this is an enormous platform and important issues were brought up through the years that I got to and we got to opine about and, and use the platform um, to say things we felt was imp- were, were important uh, in the world of sports and when social issues intersected with the world of sports. And I'll uh, always cherish it. Um, but uh, all things come to an end. And that's the end. This yeah. is the end of my run on first. The only constant life that's is right. change. Stephen A., thank you so much. Feel better. I will see right, you. Child. I'll see you on Monday, okay? okay. You, you try not All to talk best. too be- much. You're not supposed to be talking. Absolutely. Uh, and Sam, I want to give you a chance to be uh, able to say something. Sorry, I know we only have 15 real seconds Real quick, left. TV announcement to come oh, in the following oh. days. Okay. I'll be doing morning radio, Keyshawn, J. Will, and Max, and there will be a TV announcement about ESPN to come in the coming Get days. it, Sorry, Max. My- no, you got me thinking. Max What's it going to be? Tell I love us, Max. you. Come love on. you, love you. Best of luck. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.